Mark Claire here for Bounding Into Comics. And believe it or not, guys, believe it or not, there could, now I emphasize the word could, there could be some good news coming out of the Marvel DC Universe. This article is from Spencer Bakuli over at BoundingIntoComics.com. You can find it in the description of this video. There's a rumor, now it is a rumor, <laughs> hence the could. There's a rumor being reported that Marvel's Daredevil Born Again will see the return of Deborah Ann Wool and Eldon Henson, respectively, as Karen Page and Foggy Nelson. Now, originally, Daredevil Born Again, by the way, Spencer Bakuli, nailing it with this article. Uh, he is writing about the rumor that was published in The Hollywood Reporter about this casting, about the Daredevil Born Again series reportedly bringing back these very popular characters. Now, it was originally reported to recap this whole thing. Originally, these characters were not set to return in the Daredevil Born Again series, but then something happened a few months ago, and the entire show was just thrown out and scrapped altogether. Whatever Kevin Feige was seeing going on, I think he realized this is going to be yet another disaster if things continue on their course. So while we don't know what's really going to go down, we don't even know if this is true or not. But the fact that Kevin Feige did see what he saw and saw enough of Daredevil of what they had done so far with the Daredevil Born Again series and decided to scrap everything, change directions, or get a new script is to me at least somewhat of a good sign. Because look, for all the things we might say about Kevin Feige and the direction of the MCU in the last four or five years, this is the guy who's oversaw the early days of the Marvel Cinematic Universe. This is the guy who gave us some pretty damn good core movies with Captain America, Iron Man. I even liked The Incredible Hulk. That was a universal thing. We don't even need to talk about that, but I like that movie as well. It wasn't really a faggy thing. All of those early movies that really dragged a lot of us fans who finally were seeing a representation of characters that we grew up on the screen being portrayed in a fairly accurate way, a fairly comic accurate way, uh, and with high production value, with actors we recognize, was great. And Daredevil was very similar on Netflix, had nothing to do with Kevin Feige until the whole thing was merged together, and now they have the rights to all of it. It did seem like things were probably going to go in a very different direction, especially after what we all saw when Daredevil appeared in She-Hulk. We can say whatever we want. That's a different kind of tone of show. I do not need to see Daredevil doing a walk of shame for some reason, holding his superhero booties. I don't need to see that. I hope, I hope that Kevin Feige has looked at what they have with Daredevil. They already had a very successful, well, we don't necessarily need to talk about season three. Season one and two of Daredevil, some of the best TV, the best comic hero TV I've ever seen. So of course, if we're really returning to that, and these actors were a big part of that as far as I'm concerned. Uh, Deborah Ann Wool just nailed Karen Page, and Eldon Henson was incredible as Foggy. I couldn't even imagine anyone else playing Foggy. So to me, if they were going to have these characters at all, it had to be these actors. It couldn't just be new people, or they were just going to have to not have the characters, which I believe was probably the initial idea. I believe they were just going to move on, not include these characters, do some new mcu -y Daredevil thing, and the fact that they scrapped the script, and the fact that this rumor has come out is at least a small hope, a small hope that, look, I don't have hope for the MCU overall, but if nothing else, let's just hope that Kevin Feige saw what was going on and said, look, we can avoid another catastrophe. We just got to go back to what worked in Netflix. Are they doing that? I don't know, but if they really do bring back Deborah Ann Wool and Eldon Henson as Karen Page and Foggy Nelson, that is at least a step in the right direction and a potential good sign. So, I will say, for today, it's a new year, new me. I'm a little bit excited about this possibility. Let's just put it that way. I know I'm tempering things a lot here, but I'm a little bit excited about it. My friends, be sure to check out the full article over at BoundingIntoComics.com, and be sure to hit that subscribe button and ring that little notification bell so you don't miss any of the great content from the team here at Bounding Into Comics.